when we draw political districts that unfairly disadvantage uh, communities based on, on race, then we produce districts where voters are, are given, are, are, are the, the candidates that have to run in those districts have to run to extremes because there's less, there's no need to compromise. You don't have to go out and appeal to as many different types of communities. So you run for you run for the most extreme version that's going to shore up your base with one community to make it out of a primary. And if you make it out of that primary because your district is drawn in a way that disadvantages competition, then the most extreme candidates become the person that's on the general ballot. And that is what we see driving our political discourse today. And it's going to drive us off the edge of a cliff. We've seen this play out time and time again around, around the world. We don't have to do this. So regardless of the outcome of, of our case, we're calling for Americans to join us in building a pro-democracy movement.